Yo, what's going on guys? My name is Clay and in today's video, we're going to be checking out my brand new M16 class setup in Modern Warfare 2. If you guys are new to my channel, make sure to hit that subscribe button and also like the video. So if you guys could do that for me, I'd really appreciate it and it helps out this video a bunch. Jumping straight into the attachments. As you can see, this is my attachments. I'm going to go over kind of why I picked it. I mean, it is a blueprint and it actually ended up working really, really well. I don't recommend this optic. I like to say that like any optic is like personal preference, but I do like this one a little bit. With the tuning, I went with negative 2.13 ounces for the weight to add aim down sight speed. And I will put the eye position all the way to close. Over on the stock, the Torrent Span 9 stock is already on this blueprint. It adds aim walking speed, sprint speed, and recoil control. I actually could feel the aim walking speed like a lot with this um, attachment. The tuning I went with is negative 3.10 ounces for aim down sight speed and negative 1.47 inches for aim walking speed. That helped it out a lot too. And the underbarrel on the blueprint was the X10 Grave Digger. It adds aiming auto stability, hip fire accuracy, and recoil stabilization. It takes away a little bit of walking speed and aim down sight speed. The tuning I went with is negative 0.59 ounces for aim down sight speed and negative 0.30 inches for aim walking speed. Over on the muzzle, which I actually like this muzzle a lot, is the FJX Fulcrum Pro. It adds vertical recoil control and horizontal recoil control. The tuning I went with is 0.39 ounces for recoil stabilization and 0.19 inches for recoil control. The barrel on the blueprint is the 11.5 inch TH4 barrel. It adds aim down sight speed, movement speed, and hip recoil control. With all of the buffs on this gun and these attachments, this gun didn't even feel like a three round burst, like how fast it shoots now. The tuning on the barrel though is 0.29 pounds for recoil steadiness and 0.21 inches for damage range. That's gonna do it for this class setup. If you guys end up trying this class setup out and you like it, please let me know down in the comments. Or if you have a better class setup for me to use, please let me know what that is down in the comments. I have a crazy gameplay. I ended up dropping an MGB. I hope you guys enjoy that. Make sure to hit the like button if you do. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace. All right, we're going to be checking out the M16. No, 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 no. Turn your mic off. Most of my class setups recently have been kind of a troll, but they've been like working like because I've been using blueprints and not even changing the attachments. Uh, this gun this class setup is good i just put my own tuning on it of course but it feels like an automatic it's like a very fast paced m16 class I've been kind of challenging myself to get a nuke with every video. He's dead, All right? No, game. Oh my 
God, he's getting so close to killing me. That guy kills me, of course. What is this spawn? I spawned in the middle of the map. I might not be able to get a nuke with this gun, but. Stoop dog, what you doing? No, I'm scared of that. I'm scared of this fire here. He died. I'm running. A oh, Wilson. My god, look at that kill feed. No, 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 no. I don't know what I'm on or else I'd call in this advance. No, 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 no. All 
I'm not picking that. There's the nuke right there. Oh my god, 63 kills. No, I auto mantled, bro. <clears throat> this class is actually really good. I, I'd maybe change the optic, but. Seventy six kills. I think we could we could end it there. Calling the MGB. It was like ten more seconds. Seventy six kills. GG's.